And moments ago, Salvi accepted the nomination from Dayton Moore. He'll be wearing number 21. For the first time, all Roberto Clemente Award nominees and previous award recipients will have the option to wear number 21 on their uniforms. Joining players from Puerto Rico and others, Carlos was supposed to start tomorrow, but Mike Miner was placed on the injured list. Yeah, I think he's ready to go. And it is blasted into deep left center field. Benintendi is at the track, and he's got it right in front of the wall. Starling right-handed hitter, and here is the pitch. And an off-speed pitch dropped into right field for a base hit. Gets a split that stays up, and that'll give you an indication of just how strong Starling Marte is. Marte. His batting average with the A's now up to 345. That one's lined to center, and that's going to be a hit. Marte will get up to second base and stop there. So Matt Olson goes after the first pitch from Carlos Hernandez, and he's got a base hit. Runners go, and the throw goes to third, and it's in time. Salvi just put a little extra oomph on it. That's a strike him out, throw him out. For Sean Manaya, in this month of September, in those two starts, he's thrown the ball extremely well. That's your focus. Out number one each and every inning, but especially when you've got a couple contact guys looming there at the top. Line, base hit left center field. So Witt is four for six in this series, and he's on to begin the bottom of the first. Benintendi's driven in 59. He has hit 15 home runs. Grounded through the shift. Here comes Nicky Lopez home, and the Royals have grabbed the lead. So again, the Oaklands have two on, and now a fly ball into short right. And Dozier comes in from right and makes a sliding play. I mean, Dozier, he came a long way hard for that ball. Grounded back to the middle. Nicky Lopez has it. Do the Royals get an out? They do. Is there any more room on Nicky Lopez's highlight tape? I mean, I don't think there is. So now the A's have first and third two outs for Elvis Andrews. Now the three two to Elvis. It's lighting to left, and that's a hit, and it's going to knock in a pair. Elvis Andrews, two big hits last night and a huge hit tonight. Two out, two run single to give the A's a two to one lead. Two two pitch to Hunter Dozier, swings and misses on a fastball 96. Just threw it by him, and that's out number two. And another change is grounded fair in Santana. There is nobody covering at third. Hanser Alberto didn't realize that Carlos Santana stood on first and it was a tag play. So he stood on the bag to receive the throw and was ready to throw it back to first base. So a mental error turns a double play, potential double play into a runner at third. The A's looking to increase their 2-1 lead and here comes Canna. Here's a 2-2. Fastball grounded. Up the middle, through the draw to an infield to the left of Lopez. In to score is Olsen. It's 3-1 Athletics. Mark Kenna with his 56th run batted in. And there are two outs now for Matt Olsen with an opportunity to reach the century mark in RBIs. It's an ongoing career high for Matt sitting at 99. Hits this one the other way, and it's hit pretty well. Benintende back. Benintende near the wall. He leaps up, and that baby is gone. Olsen goes the other way. That's a two-run shot. He's over 100 RBIs, and it's home run number 35. And we know all about the barbecue and KC, but Matt Olsen says, how about an oppo taco for the fans? Mondi hits it on the ground to short. Andrews gets the out at second. No double play, and the Royals get a run. And because of no double play, Mondesi gets an RBI for a third straight game. Alberto, he's due for a hit with him loaded this year. He's 0 for 4. Fastball up is grounded at the middle and into center field. Benintendi scores. Mondesi scores. And Alberto gets that big hit. And the Royals are down by one. And that one's hit toward Harrison. He spins. He throws the second. Kemp picks it. And what a double play by the Athletics. My goodness. And a much needed double play as well. Harrison to Kemp to Olsen. Top of the fifth. The A's have him loaded and nobody out. And here's Kemp. Have to, have to capitalize here. And that is a base hit center field. Canna will score. And it's 6-4. to four. 
Tony Kemp comes through with an RBI single. Josh Harrison put a charge into a couple balls this evening. He's not been afraid to get it going early in the count as well. That's a base hit to right field. Brown scores. Here comes Jan Gomes. He's going to score Kemp to third. Harrison with a big hit. And it's 8 to 4, the A's lead. Salvador Perez will bat with nobody on two down. Salvi tonight has flight out deep to center. He's also singled and scored. Right center field, deep. Back goes Brown. It's gone for number 44. Another Salvador Perez home run. Salvador Perez is unstoppable. He is Salvi strong, no doubt about it. He's on some kind of tear. The fans are loving it here. And now Jay Hay bats. And that's another hit. Slaps it to the right side. Trotting in to score is Kemp. An RBI single for Jay Hay. It's a three RBI night for the A's leadoff man. And it is 9-5 Oakland. And here comes Starling Marte. And there's another hit. This one toward left center field. It's going to score Andrus easily. Harris is going to head to third. They're going to wave him home. And the throw to the plate is late. Harrison slides it and scores. And now it's 11 to 5. Yeah, it looked like Oliveris kite bobbled this ball out there. Gets through him. Going to allow Josh Harrison to score all the way from first base. Chris Davis goes the other way, and that's going to get down for a hit. Marte's going to score easily. So Chris Davis with an RBI single to make it 12 to 5. And that will be sinking in center and down for his fourth hit and second RBI. Have a night. And there's a little soft liner over the head of the first baseman that drops safely into right field. And Hunter Dozier will cross home plate. All right, Benny, have a perfect night, especially with runners on base. Grounded right yes. side. It through. All right. Base hit number five. And RBIs two and three on the night. It is 12 9. That is outstanding. Now he has a three five hit game career. So the bases are loaded. 12 10 the score. Two outs at the bottom of the night. Dozier at third. Alberto at second. Lopez at first. First pitch. Up the middle, knocked down by Chapin. He scrambles after his throw to first, and that's the ball game. The A's hang on against the very feisty Kansas City Royals team who took it right down to the, the final out. 